Hey everybody, Klaus here. Welcome back for more Mother 3. Last time, we were able to get fuel out of the um, forest that was on a huge fiery flamey fire. Okay, this episode, well, we're gonna be returning home as we were, uh, we were advised to get some rest there, so let's do it. Oh, not before getting ordered by Isaac. Flint. Power time, mate. I already were taking a rest here. Mighty heavy rain, isn't it? Well, it's better than heavy rain than having a forest burning. <laughs> I, think, I think I'll join you after when we... Sure. Um, no, like, we haven't seen Hanala lately. Let's see. Actually, I was up in the mountains and picking mushrooms. I was up there, I caught sight of Hanawa. And then I was taking a break by the river. And Wars off in the distance. You don't think that could be a Drago, can it? After uh, I heard, I think it might have been screams. Hey Flint, now the kids are back home, right? I suppose we think so, yeah. But better to be heading home, which is where we were heading in the first place before we got interrupted. And hey, there's that caravan. Letter from Hanawa. Dear Flint, it's like you say the words of children have been running around the mountains and uh, you know, tell us ladies, it's the moment we arrive. Else is staring and full of energy is ever well look is still a bit cuddled. Neither and seems tired of playing at all. Her father seems sad to say goodbye to his grandchildren after seeing them for the first time in so long, which should be owned by this evening. And forgotten how nice and refreshing the mountain air is. You're always covered in the smell of sheep back in Townsville Road, so I really wish you could have been here taking this air. Next time we visit, let's ask one of our neighbors to tend to the sheep so we can all come up here as a family. Well, listen, I we're always thinking about you. When you get home this evening, I'll start cooking some of your favorite omelets right away. Love, your dearest Hanawa. That letter seems kind of troublesome, as, as Hanawa's never made it back. Oh, there's some of that. Oh, it's trying to cook at the cold. I'll go find it. Probably taking shelter from the rain somewhere. It's getting late, so we shall all look for, go look for them. Let's get the other villagers out, too. Wow, talk about really helpful like villagers. Jeez, I wish every Hans in this world could be this nice. <laughs> oh, oh, please take me with you. I'm sure it'll be helpful. We will take him with us. <laughs> I love how that translated to whoa whoa. Uh, I don't know why I find that just so amazing. That's just a simple puzzle, I guess. I don't know. I don't think there's anything I've forgotten up here. Kevin. Oh well. We got more important things to worry about, like finding Hanawa. First, let me see this. Nope. It's pretty that also, yeah, of course the, um, golf cookie, um, goes down. 
Like everyone went to the prayer sanctuary. I don't know how about to be honest. <laughs> I'm just I'm totally just the guy to help you out. Uh sure. We have a total drunky helping us. Um hooray. <laughs> I don't know. First and foremost, we better head to the forest. Oh, there you are, friend. I must say, one is split and search the forest for an hour. Oh, what a coincidence. We're heading there, too. Yeah, no joke. Must be true happiness in one sense. In one sense. So this old geezer here. I like this. I like the joints. I don't need to stay here because I'm old. There's nobody so aware of just how strong I really am. I mean, yeah, but the fact that you're out in the rain this old should be testament to that. Uh, I guess not. <laughs> this that's cold rain. I don't like it. It doesn't seem like it's ever gonna stop. We should be thankful you had this much rain, given you haven't had this much rain in such a long time. Alright, I and I didn't I didn't see me. Ow. Kill me. The exact same bat I wasn't able to find this spot before. Ah. Alright. We have a couple of new enemies here. Including the, um, Mighty Body Snake. This thing can be old and annoying as this thing does have the potential to uh, poison you. But, if. Ah, uh, wasn't I get, able to get one that time. You can actually get a, um, antidote from them. But, obviously, um,. And no, here's poison. Okay, what I'm gonna be doing here is um, I'm gonna be um, doing a bit of um, enemy finding, enemy finding to hopefully increase my level at least one. So um, I'll see you guys in a moment. <laughs> okay, that was a pointless cut. I mean. <laughs> So as soon as I was, I was, uh, as soon as I say I was gonna build up my levels, um, when I gain a level, <laughs> that was pretty funny timing. Okay, you remember that one area we couldn't go through because of the large fire? You know, I get bored of the flames and so intense at the time. Look at this area it can hit pretty tight the fire too. Yep. You have a new pathway that's open that's actually where we're supposed to be here and... Well, that was unexpected. Okay, before I forget, uh, I used to show off on his ability here, Sniff. Kind of like Jeff Spike Man in, um, in Mother 2, except it doesn't display stats, unfortunately. The Sniff Command, what does this? Well, Sniff out weaknesses. That is something that's pretty useful, but um, at the same time, kind of irrelevant to us at this point. Yeah, it's kind of irrelevant to this one because we don't, we don't, we don't have any possible weakness of it, some of these enemies. I shouldn't say anything, but I'm kind of surprised those mighty mighty snakes haven't unleashed their poisonous things. Oh, many, many charms. Let's see, who do I want to give that to? Well, the only person I can get that to. Let me one of our 
That only fables the. I right, really did a number of this forest. Can't believe my eyes. Look at this plane. This tree is now brightened too. I'm walking the path right ahead, unfortunately. I'm such a big tree to be ripped down like this. There's one thing for sure, whatever did this, it wasn't human. And no, it wasn't me. <laughs> well, are you saying you're not human? What do we do now? It has, a, it has a path completely blocked. Actually, I know when the kids might be stuck out there. Because of all the knocked down trees blocking the way. Even though it's not the most correct path, we should find it like another way around. Yep, splitting up. Yeah, because that's always a solution. Hey. Hey, slider and fuel. I found the now and the kids. Yeah, last we saw you, you were injured pretty bad. I'm always a good enough kid. Don't treat me like some injured cod. You Even though you were injured earlier, you seem to make you made a record freaking recovery there. We'll take care. We'll take care of things here. Okay, you keep pushing on ahead. All right. Well, they're working on that tree over there. Guess we should. We're going over here. But first, I want to go and say my say my game real quick. Okay. Now I'm ready to press on. Interesting. Some. On the wall in here is darker. Shaded in the rest of the wall. Maybe we'll be able to do something with that. Maybe not. All the forest critters are acting weird, and I'm suddenly getting real bad vibes here. No, I mean that it's good. Uh, contradicting statement. Much? You getting bad vibes in a? What is that? Wait. Bad vibes in a good way? Does not contradict what you're saying there? Uh, sorry for that, that was Skype. And no, good bad vibes don't make any sense. What do you have to say? This is a guess, but I'd say a drug climbed up from here. Looks like a drug of claw. Uh, how? How could a drug do this? I mean, aren't they. Gentle creatures. Kind of what I was saying. Gentle creatures. Peaceful creatures, excuse me. I used the wrong terminology. I get that I get something very bad is happening to the forest, the people and the animals and me. Oh, we have two people saying they're not human. Okay. What is it, money? Only tried to start acting weird. Almost like Tony found something. Yep, told it. Oh, look up there. After that low quality howl. Bit of thread right over there. A clap of lightning sounded. <laughs> Oh, well, thunder sounded as soon as we saw that cloth. 
That obviously doesn't mean anything good. There's something on top of this cliff. Old Man West, what are you doing here? Sorry to say, there's nothing wicked the old man can do to help us out. Really? Let's have to talk to him. Let's see. Oh, but don't tell me you didn't find this cliff. I know how you feel, Miss Skelly. Like this cliff face is just too dangerous. You know, maybe my son can be of use. I don't know if I'll help any, but let's get him here so he can try. Wow. I'll have faith in your son. Phony. Bring my son back here. My son's name is... A strange but nice guy with unexpected skills. Duster! One of the cooler characters in the game. Name is Duster. Got that? He is never stop. Gah! That's right. Don't, don't forget the smell now. Gah! That's right, all right. I tell a yellow ribbon to your collar. Go in the ribbon, he'll know exactly what's going on. Now, back! Yeah, we can always count on Phony, the most awesome dog ever. Well, aside from Jack. <laughs> Go, Phony! Run! Run like you never ran before! There's Duster himself. <laughs> so Bunny just drags Duster across the forest while he's still sleeping. <laughs> How did you sleep through that, dude? Seriously. Duster. Long last, it's time to put the thief skills you studied to scholar to the test. Now it shows your wall stipple technique. Right here, right now. So they take me, but this is my first time using it for real. It works. This area looks scalable here. That's a pretty handy ability. To jam staples into the wall. Let's do that, Mike. Here we're coming up. Alright. Scale the wall and check out that cloth. Suddenly the music has gone somber here. The same color as in Alice's dress. Yeah. Oh! Back attack. Hey, it says more felt homesick. Wow, that was so threatening there, buddy. <laughs> Sorry for that interruption, Supremo. Just kidding. 
Alright, so we're gonna get the, this stuff here. It's bread, beef jerky. Beef jerky is really good recovery item. Oh, nice! Um, okay. That's an example of one of Tester's abilities right there. It's just like, as soon as we enter the battle, um, from random chance, Tester will bust out a, um, a surprise opening attack. Either that or, um, Tester will just spring behind an enemy that counts as getting a back right. That's one of the, um, that's one of the, um, exceptions to this. Alright, um, normally it end things off here, but I feel like making this a uh, longer video, so let's press on. Hey, what? There's something, there's someone here. Hey, it's those same pig guys from earlier. Are they human? What are they doing? There it is. It's like they're identifying machine of sorts. Ha! <laughs> we scared him so much he's dropped his notebook. It's attacking us! Alright, the reconstructed caribou. Alright, now the reconstructed I should have killed it before entering this battle. Uh that's gonna be a stable with me, um in our keys, isn't it? And speaking of stable, I'm gonna use the wall symbol here. As uh unfortunately it didn't work right there, um the constructed caribou is indeed subtitled to the um pulse tables. Trying to show off exactly what it does. Ah. Yeah, you say that pulse table does put an enemy down and sort of overall. As long as they pin down they can't do much of anything. I was kind of surprised I was able to land that power smash for the first turn. Nah, I didn't think I was going to fall off there. Okay. All Sable is a really good technique, even in battle. Oh, we're in prison torque. <laughs> well, I wasn't able to save Boney there, unfortunately. Unfortunately, the same tends to attack every other turn. Every time it tends to attack everyone. I'm going berserk. Ah, that was that was very very not good. All right, come on, pin him down, pin him down, pin him down. Yeah! Alright, come on, can I actually smash him this time? Yeah! Awesome! There it goes. Fortunately, Pony couldn't get any experience. Oh well. Ah. I just gotta get this notebook here. Yeah, we'll give it a read. The following is written in poor handwriting. All the creatures around here suck. We need to make them cooler. So the theme will be tougher, rougher, better. We'll mix and match this and that to create all new things no one's ever seen before. I dub it the Fascinating Chimera Project. Let's reconstruct and modify stuff slowly and steadily. 
reconstructing stuff to make them quote unquote cooler. I oppose that idea. I, seriously, I, I seriously oppose that idea. But anyway, now we're taking out like a reconstructed caribou. I think we're good to end things off here. So, I guess next time on Mother Three, um, I guess we'll explore this great cliff more, right? See you guys then.